first I'm happy to see that people are out to vote. Uh, voting is a, is a right of Namibians which came at a huge sacrifice and we want to encourage Namibians to exercise this right because their vote is their voice. Uh, that is how they participate in the governance of their country by electing those that are going to, to, to discharge their powers as the absolute sovereign on their behalf. In these positions as local authority councillors and as regional councillors uh, as, uh, as representing their political parties from association. And I was happy with the process inside. It was quite smooth and very well organized. Uh, and I'm happy that I have exercised my right to vote as an Indian. I encourage all others to come out while it's early and vote so that uh, by three, four, all of us will have voted. Well, I, I think the campaign process reflects the maturity of democracy in Namibia. Uh, it was peaceful, people were tolerant to one another, they were articulating what they were going to do in order to address the needs of the, of the people. Unfortunately, we, uh, we campaigned uh, during a period of COVID, and so that somehow limited the, the activities of people, but besides that, everything went well. And I want to encourage Namibians to, to, to respect the democracy that we have chosen ourselves as a governance system in this country. It allows for diversity, so we should articulate our our views about to what we are going to do when we are elected. We should make our choices without fear about who we want to represent us. And we should not be divided because of that. We are still one Namibia, one nation. We are simply just exercising our democracy.